In this work, we explore the use of wav 2 x 2 features for speech and motion recognition. The wav 2 x 2 model consists of an encoder which compresses the raw audio into a sequence of vectors, then this sequence is masked at some time steps, and a transformer has to reconstruct a quantized version of the original vectors. And that's the pre-training task, which is called Contrastive Masked Language Modeling. It is self-supervised and similar to BERT pre-training. Then, the original idea of wav 2 x 2 was to fine-tune this pre-trained model for automatic speech recognition, and it led to state-of-the-art results using limited training data. So, in this work, we propose to use this very same model for speech emotion recognition instead of ASR. We want to extract features from this pre-trained model and see if they are useful for emotion recognition. Also, we want to know which is the best way to extract features from this model, and if the ASR fine-tuning adds some information that benefits speech motion recognition. We first extracted features from the wav 2 x 2 model by using activations from the CNN encoder and each of the transformer blocks. This gives us 13 sequences. We hypothesized that the most relevant features might not necessarily be at the last layers, so we let our model learn weights for each of the 13 sequences, and then we averaged them. In fact, once the models were trained, we found that the largest weights were given to the middle blocks of the transformer. Then, the neural network we use is very simple to avoid overfitting. It consists of two fully connected layers applied time by step by time step, and then the resulting sequence is averaged in the time dimension. Finally, there is an output layer with softmax to predict the different emotions. We found that the CNN encoder outputs along are useful features which outperform expert features like Ishimaps. Using the output of the transformer along as feature didn't give improvements. We think that this is because of the pre-training objective, which makes these features very similar to the CNN encoder quantized representations. The best approach was to combine activations from all the transformer blocks. Extracting features from wav 2 x 2 fine-tuned for ASR didn't give good results as information from Prosody might have been lost during fine-tuning. Normalizing by speaker gave us some improvements, but to compare with other works, we didn't use this normalization, as it is an optimistic condition. The Fusion model, which also incorporates Ishimap features, was the best and rich state-of-the-art results in EMOCAP and RAPDES. Our hypothesis is that some Prosody information that is present in Ishimaps might not be present in wav 2 features, and that's all. Thanks for your attention.